to Hong Kong, where a U.S. Navy aircraft carrier is making its regular visit to the island. We got a closer look at life inside the Japan-based aircraft carrier USS George Washington that operates like a small city. Here's more. The United States Navy's Japan-based aircraft carrier USS George Washington has sailed into Hong Kong waters today for a routine visit. The 97-ton nuclear-powered carrier, based in the Japanese town of Yokosuka, brought with it the George Washington Carrier Strike Group and the carrier Air Wing 5 to the ex-British colony. The ship from the U.S. 7th Fleet makes an average of 40 visits to the ex-British colony every year, according to an official press release. One navigator says he enjoys his time on George Washington. You get to hit a lot more parts and you don't get seasick on the carriers, that's a good thing. Because <laughs> when, when I was on the uh, DDG, you get a lot of seasick. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, you get to see the world. Operating like a small city, the ship also carries with it many crew members who are responsible for a variety of services. And it's a pretty good experience. I work at the post office. So I just deliver mail to people. 5,000, 6,000 people on the ship. And yeah, pretty busy. Thousands, hundreds of thousands of pounds of mail every day. The Navy said, apart from George Washington, a guided missile cruiser and two guided missile destroyers are also in Hong Kong for the visit.